baseball mechanics. Baseball mechanics here. Today I felt, since I already did how to hit the ball good, that I'm going to be doing a bat review. And yes, I do have a lot of bats. Um, I'm not going to compare them to, the, to any other bat. I'm just going to say, you know, if they're good and things that are good about them. So, let's start off with the one on the far left. And it is the TPX Exo Grid. It's a really nice bat, has composite, doesn't flex, and that's what I like about it. Um, most of these bats don't flex, but I don't know about you guys, I don't like it when it flexes, so this is a good bat. Moving on to the next one, which is the DeMarini CF4. This is such a nice bat. It has composite in it. It's a really nice bat. Um, I love this bat. Moving on to the next bat, which is, oh, by the way, this bat does not flex. Moving on to the next bat, which is the Combat B3. Uh, this bat has no flaws except for the fact that it breaks easily. Great, has composite, it doesn't show, and that's what I like about it. It's like a humble bat. Uh, this one was given to me by Trey Vondel, um, thanks to him. Um, really nice bat. Um, yeah, no flaws. The speed is the next bat. Um, here's the thing. The speed flexes, but it has composite. It, it's a nice bat. It just flexes. And it, it's not... I don't really like the speed. It has a funky feel to it. Um, by the way, this bat does not flex. Okay, this bat's a flexor. Um, so it's all right, I mean, but I wouldn't suggest this bat. Okay, moving on to the Anderson Texilla. This is my favorite bat because it's the only bat I hit a home run with ever. So, yeah, it doesn't flex. I love this bat. Get this bat. Final bat of the day, the Stealth IMX. Flexes, but does have composite. Uh, this is an all right bat. I don't like the feel of it. Some people do. So, yeah, that's the bat review. Thanks for watching.